Sean Diddy Combs' lawyers are giving more insight into how the music mogul is adjusting in jail. After the rapper was ordered to remain in prison to await his trial on charges of racketeering, sex trafficking, and using transportation to engage in prostitution, Diddy's lawyer Mark Agnafilo describes Diddy's most difficult adjustment while in detention. He tells reporters outside of a New York courthouse October 10th per New York Daily News, quote, I think the food's probably the roughest part of it. According to a Federal Bureau of Prisons handbook obtained by E! News, the detention center offers regular heart-healthy and no-flesh dietary options to its inmates, as well as access to purchase food from the commissary. Food options on the commissary list include tuna and chili sauce, honey buns, cashews, instant grits, protein bars, and spam. Diddy's other attorney, Anthony L. Rico, adds that the 54-year-old is, quote, making an adjustment amid his legal setback. According to NBC News, he says, quote, sometimes the more you push a person and down, the stronger they get. Nobody's okay with staying in jail. Diddy has pleaded not guilty to the charges and is currently being held at the Metropolitan Detention Center in Brooklyn. Amid his incarceration, Diddy has been placed on suicide watch. It's a common practice that is not indicative of the mental state for high-profile individuals upon admittance to a federal facility. Diddy's trial is set for May 5th, 2025, with the Grammy winner likely to testify in court. His attorney previously said in TMZ's documentary, The Downfall of Diddy, the Indictment, quote, I think he's very eager to tell his story. Mark also said in a previous statement to E! News following Diddy's arrest, quote, these are the acts of an innocent man with nothing to hide. He looks forward to clearing his name in court.